Hey guys, so I'm back with a quick video on this wig that I have on. It's been highly reviewed on YouTube and of course, I wanted to come on in and give y'all life, honey. Yes, ma'am. Look at that. Y'all see that part? Did that. But yes, okay, so this is the Model Model Dream in the color DKPU. Um... I want to say I got this from Wig Types. It was like $26, I want to say. I got three other wigs with this, that, uh, two other wigs that I will be doing a review on as well. Um, long story short, I got it and then I was looking at the reviews on YouTube and they were like, the wig looked amazing. I mean, amazing. So, I decided to get this. Please disregard my background. I'm watching catching up on the dancing dolls y'all know and my fan is going on right over here so yes this color is pretty um i wanted to do different and with this wig they have a different a couple different colors and the purple stood out to me because my best friend died of lupus it'll be three years in october and i feel like this was like calling me like i had got a lot of purple makeup because i wanted to do a purple makeup um look inspired by her and i just never got into it but this wig gave me the life to get there so y'all see this makeup um i'm still learning still doing my thing but i've gotten better and i'm gonna start showcasing that with videos on that too but anyway back to this wig so i have a small head and um I have an undercut as well so working with this working with this wig was a little tricky because um it's really too big and even with me um tightening up the back now every i'm gonna sh put pictures in here of how the wig looked when i first got it um how the parting looked as well as the inside so be uh, somewhere in here i'm gonna put that in there so I just did the wig today. Um, like I said, I ordered these from Wig Types. Wigtypes.com. I ordered on a Wednesday and they were here on that Friday. So very, very fast shipping or whatever. And y'all, I'm in love with this hair. Like, it's a really good yakky texture. I know y'all y'all can see that. Y'all can see that. And the way that it is like parted and stuff. You have to really just work with it to make it yours. With this bang, all I did really was I combed it over like such. And y'all know this is a lace front. I combed it over like such. Cause, and then all I did was pushed it in my face. And that was it. And this part, yes, it's a little awkward. But you just have to roll with it, you know. Just roll with it. And like I said, it's a lace front. I'm going to zoom in on this parting i tweezed it a little bit not too much because when you all see the pictures you'll see that the parting space is pretty decent it's just a little bulky i would say and then underneath i did not show this but underneath i put some foundation i did the revlon color stay whipped um and it just worked really good i did not put any concealer on after i put the wig on i just put the foundation underneath um, I will give you all updates. I will not be wearing this like really on a daily basis because I work in a manufacturing plant and we have to wear hats and I do not want nothing to go wrong with this wig up under her hat. But I am going to wear it um, all day today as well as you know when I have time to go places and stuff like that. But I had to come to y'all with this initial review of this hair y'all. Like, if y'all do not have this wig, please go get it. Um, like I said, I'm going to do the other, the two more reviews on the two other wigs. And I'm trying to get the Nisha wig as well as the Bobby Boss Copper wig. I've heard lots and lots of things on that. 
and I really want those too. Um, I've been natural about a year now and it's tempting for me to go back to the relaxer because it's just easy for me to manage my hair. But with these wigs giving me this much life, baby, I might just cornrow that thing straight to the back and keep it moving. This, my hair underneath here, I have, um, so I have like eight braids crisscross and then going I have eight braids crisscross and I have four going back and then with the front I did individual box braids um so I have one braid here which is giving me the extra volume up here because if you look at other people's videos I really don't have a lot of volume here everything's just like one dimensional like really flat but I have one braid here it's a thick braid that's going across will come up and then goes back and then I have one braid over here that's just really slim and going down so that my parting space would lay flat. But yes, y'all, definitely y'all need to go pick up this wig if y'all haven't. It is a must have. Like, even though this hair is synthetic, it feels really, really good. Like, OMG. Y'all see that color? Like, I'm using natural line, and y'all see that color? Yes, it's really this purple and black. So, if you don't want this bold statement, please stick to, like, the 1B, the 2, and the 4, or whatever. But if you want the color, please get, please get the color, because it looks gorgeous. It's very, very gorgeous. Like, they did the damn thing with this wig, y'all. It's two snaps, because they did that. But anyway, guys, see y'all on more reviews on this wig as well as my initial reviews on the other two wigs i um purchased with this wig from wigtypes.com um peace and love to the next video Mwah. bye